655, tragic breaking news out of Oneida County this morning. Three young children have been killed in a house fire in Rome. State police were called to Pine Haven Circle off Oswego of Road near Blossville just after 1145 last night. They found heavy fire and smoke and three children dead inside the house. Jennifer Sanders is live for us this morning. Jen. Yeah, very good morning to you, Dan. Six people lived inside that home. As you said, three children died. A very, very tragic situation. As we were in the neighborhood, a lot of neighbors coming out looking. Even the house next door actually had a lot of uh, damage from that smoke as well. So very intense flames that claimed the lives of those three children. Now, here's what we know so far. It happened around just before midnight yesterday. And we know that when police arrived just before midnight, there was a lot of heavy fire. It actually pushed them back. Now, we're told the father did try to go back in. Him and the mother made it out, tried to go back in. But, of course, those flames were just too intense. Four-year-old Elise Crowe was found dead, along with three-year-old Patrick Crowe. That's her brother. And Tempers Crowe, a two-year-old child found dead in that home. One-year-old Cadence Crowd was taken upstate with Burns and the children's parents, Gabrielle as well as Patrick, they initially refused treatment, but after that they were treated for some burns. Trooper Jack Heller explains what happened when they arrived. Uh, we were able to meet with the mother and father who were outside attempting to get back in uh, with, along with her one-year-old. The one-year-old was transported immediately to upstate uh, with uh, injuries to both arms. And then, uh, unfortunately, uh, when firefighters arrived in the heavy, heavy fire conditions, um, the back of the uh, residence was heavy, uh, engulfed with flames. The intense heat, uh, unfortunately for firefighters, pushed them back, and also the, ro the roof eventually did fall into the uh, residence. Uh, it was determined at that point that uh, we believe all three children, two-year-old, two three-year-old, and four-year-old, were in a bedroom, and unfortunately they weren't able to get out. Okay. And you talked about... And state police trooper Jack, or Jack Keller right there, of course, describing what happened. Now, he also described just, of course, the anguish of the parents as they tried to get back in to save their children. Uh, we'll hear more from him and more updates throughout the day. And we'll also hopefully learn a cause of what caused this devastating fire out here in Rome. We'll keep you updated here on News Channel 9 as well as local SYR.